And this is the after. Look at this dump truck. There's honestly no fixing this, so let's just move on. Hello, people of the world. So today we are dressing up as Harry Styles because, you know, he's just like a very big fashion icon, recently on the cover of Vogue. I talk about him a lot on my channel. So before we actually get onto anything spicy, he always has his like nails painted. I think they're always like painted black. So, like the dedicated YouTuber that I am, I'm gonna also paint my nails black. So I recently just like ripped off my acrylics. That was fun, not so fun for my nails. So right now I'm just trying to buff them and just like really salvage as much nail bed as I can. So I'll get back to you after I'm done destroying my nails. One nail down, nine more to go. Okay, so I just finished doing my nails and now it's time for the makeup. But the thing is, I don't think Harry Styles really wears like a lot of makeup. So I want to keep my makeup really light by just doing my eyebrows, maybe eyeliner, and that's it, you know? We're gonna keep it simple. Okay, I'm Harry Styles now. <laughs> So it kind of sucks that the suit doesn't exactly match or cover the pants, but you know, I really don't have a Gucci wardrobe to just choose from. So we're gonna work with what we got. I don't really know how to style my hair either because, you know, he always has like short, luxurious hair and I have a mop on my head. Before we actually complete the final look, we have to put on the rings, you know, the famous rings. I try to pick out like the biggest rings that I could find. So I have this Vivian Westwood one, this Amazon one, and this other ring. Are these so nice, big man hands? <laughs> worthy performance i really not sure what can top that now but it's time to move on to our second outfit okay let me explain what we're gonna do for the hair because billy obviously has her neon green roots and i don't have neon green roots if you didn't notice so we have to find somewhere not to fake it and i am too lazy to actually buy a wig so we're gonna do a little arts and crafts, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just gonna go find a picture of just like neon green and print that out. Waste a bunch of toner in the process. So we got the goods and now it's time to just like cut it, I think. And it's gonna look something like this. But we're gonna make it more natural, don't worry. So here is what we have. Let's see. <laughs> Wait, okay. The thing is, I don't know how, how to make it stay flat on my head, you know? It is a new day, a new era, a new beginning. And today, we're becoming Billie Eilish. And today, we actually bought materials. Because, as you can tell by this previous footage, my green DIY paper hair was a bit of a failure. I I couldn't pull it off. So I went out and bought some materials. Green hair, baby. <laughs> uh, I really waste my money, don't I? See the inside hair tour. Oof. Okay, that kind of just like worked. Oh my god, this kind of looks like low key realistic. Is that just me? And I also got her clothes. Well, it's not her merch, but I know that she wears like a lot of like green, neon things, so that's exactly what I got. I thought that this shirt would be green, but it's more of like a highlighter yellow. And I know she really likes to wear baggy clothes, so I bought things um, a couple sizes bigger. Hopefully they'll like 
not just like fall off my body though okay so these are the shorts i know she really likes to wear like shorts and i literally looked everywhere in my dad's closet but i swear to god this man does not own shorts billy eilish is honestly so gorgeous i don't really think she puts on a lot of makeup um let's see yeah so we'll, we'll just use this as a reference picture i think i'm just gonna do my eyebrows you know some mascara and just like a lip gloss or something so let's travel to the fifth dimension of my bathroom Woo! look at this that was just teleportation right there actually at this point you guys have really seen me do my makeup a billion times so i will be right back very minute changes but i think we are all done for this makeup look so now it's time for the fun part the outfit girl okay i don't think you're ready for this reveal okay so please prepare your eyes oh! high key i think this is like the most successful look of them all like high key though Hi, key though. Why am I trying to sound swag? I'm not swag. And I know she really likes chains to like layer a bunch. So I just layered like this chain, this necklace, and like got some cool earrings going on. And honestly, I think we did a good job. Okay, I think we did a good job. Tell me I'm not Billie Eilish right now. Tell me to my face, I'm not Billie Eilish. If I walk in the room, we would be unrecognizable, bitch. So let's summarize today's look. Would I wear this out in public? Probably not. I'm just honestly not as cool as Billy to be able to rock this in public. <sighs> Sorry, that really took a lot out of me. <sighs> okay, so yeah. So I probably would not wear this in public, but it was really, really fun being her. Like I like just feel confident, bad bitch energy. <sighs> uh, but yeah, I am low-key starting to get like allergies from this goddamn wig i'm nasally like janice yeah do you have a cat because ah, it's already happening ah, you hear that? Ah, 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 ah. i'm gonna take this wig off and i shall see you guys tomorrow so tune in Christmas, hey everyone, it's Christmas, if you guys can tell. I know Christmas wasn't on a Wednesday, but my days got messed up because of the Billie Eilish wig, so let's pretend everything is in chronological order, please. December 25th, baby. I don't know why I'm so hyper, probably because we just opened all our gifts. Today, we are leveling up in life becoming a model i know many of you guys probably already thought that i was a model <laughs> i know um but unfortunately i am not at this moment in time but you know if you're an agent ready to scout me i'm ready for you so if you guys can already tell today's celeb of the day is miss bella hadid bella hadid is literally so gorgeous and in my opinion has like the best style out of all of the models you know out of like Kylie Jenner, Hailey Bieber I'm literally going to need to physically change the bone structure of my face because this does not look like this plus I think it'd be better for my ego if we didn't stand right next to each other so a lot of contouring is going to be involved because of my hooded eyes so it looks weird and <laughs> it looks like like a three-year-old just like painted on my eye honestly the more i just stare at this eye in the mirror since i'm only looking at this one eye i feel like a cyclops okay there's a reason why the title of this video is dressing like different celebrities 
not doing my makeup like different celebrities. My face looks orange. Spot the difference? Cause I sure can't. Okay, anyways, we're just gonna move on. Cause I really, I'm gonna have a breakdown if I keep continuing. Okay, you look like Bella Hadi from the side. Okay, so we are going to be recreating this iconic look from Miss Bella. She's wearing like a white turtleneck, a leather jacket, black pants, and mini sunglasses. Okay, I think it's time that we flex some transitions, okay? Let's pretend it's TikTok for a second. Easy. I look actually horrible. Holy fuck. This is embarrassing. I don't want to put this on the internet. So see, ladies and gentlemen, I think the moral of this story is you don't copy someone else's makeup and do what fits your own face. Because this does not fit mine. She has these like mini sunglasses. Funny story about these mini sunglasses. When they were like really popular in like 2018, I bought so many of them and I would take so many pictures of them. However, my face is like pretty big, especially for these mini sunglasses. So it makes my face look so bad in these. I just don't have a face shape to wear these. But I used to take so many pictures and Lila! Okay, so I think the sunglasses cover most of the makeup, so we're pretty good on that point. Okay, I think the look is complete. The look is not too shabby if I do say so myself. The makeup is a different story. Let's see, how's she walking? Should I do like a model walk? Like the Okay. Take it seriously. person okay you guys don't understand what it's like being famous i just want to be a normal person just let me go to trader joe's so i thought i would give you guys a different angle in my bathroom because i just want to change things up here is my toilet which i don't know if you guys can see but it's there let me pose for you guys this is how I go pee pee poo poo. Today we are becoming rich. We are becoming the youngest billionaire in the world, Miss Kylie Jenner. <sighs> I wish I was rich. Anyways, so as always, we're gonna start off with our makeup, but we what we have learned from Bella is that we should not try to morph into other people's faces when you suck at makeup. So I'm just kind of gonna stick with what I know and just draw from some of her features. Like she obviously has some big lips. we got like a full V going on. So that's like the vibe that we're gonna go for. But I'm not gonna like try to make my face look like her because it just does not look good when I do that. And then we'll see it. Take it away. too far. Okay, I can't look too closely. Far away. So we're gonna go for a very simple look because Kylie Jenner, I think she like wears like very like extravagant looks that I just like don't have. So we gotta go more natural today. We're gonna create recreate this outfit. So it's just like a white t-shirt and some jeans and a bag. So it shouldn't be too hard. So the look is almost complete. But the only problem is we don't got no voluptuous titties right now okay so i need to go get a boob job and i will let you know when i am back okay we got one boob complete let's try the other boob okay so my doctor isn't gonna be a very good doctor so i'm gonna have like <laughs> one bigger than the other wait so honestly i can't find another stuffed animal the same size as this one so we just gotta deal with this unproportional boob job but now time for the butt job as you can see this is the before and this is the after look at this dump truck isn't this how she always poses 
I would rate this like a 9 out of 10. Oh! I understand why she's famous now. Okay, so today we're going to be Miss Jenny Kemp from Blackpink. I love her style, she's literally gorgeous. So let me show you the outfit inspiration that we're gonna go for today. She's wearing this like light pink top with like a black skirt and some tights. So it shouldn't be too hard to recreate. But before we actually get started into that, I think I wanna do the makeup first. And I was trying to look for like inspo pictures of like her makeup. So you can see that in this picture she has like, she has eyeliner, but it's not like a cat line, you know, it's just, on her upper lid she has some eyeshadow going on a little bit of blush straighter brows and like a lip stain going on so that's the situation i put on way too much blush okay so the makeup is done i try to go for like a more korean style makeup very light obviously i don't look korean don't be fucking racist Okay, so here is the finished look. In the picture, she was also carrying a pink Chanel bag, which we don't have right now, but I just found this at a thrift store, so, you know, it's tweed. We have pretend Chanel. I think this outfit is like super cute, very classy, very proper. Kill this love. Do, 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 Today we are becoming Ariana Grande. Excuse the mess over there. I'm moving out soon, okay? That's like my excuse. So everything is currently a mess in my life and in the material world. So um we're becoming Ariana Grande today and we're gonna be replicating this picture. I think like this is like the picture that like, gone viral, you know, of, of her and Pete Davidson. So we're gonna be recreating it and I bought a few supplies, but literally everything I didn't like think through or something. So she's wearing a yellow hoodie. So I bought this yellow hoodie and I know she, it's like oversized, right? So I literally bought extra large However, this is literally like medium, you know, like this is a medium and this is like the size of this It's not just me. Like, there's like no way that this can become a dress So I'm gonna have to like wear some shorts underneath it or something and she has her classic ponytail extension So I also bought a ponytail extension However, I didn't look at the length. So this is basically like just like a little bit longer than my actual hair Which you know really defeats the point of an extension but, um, you know, we'll work with what we got. Before I get started into the outfit, I shall do my makeup. And three, two, one. Wow, look at that. Makeup's all complete. Okay, so I need your guys' help. These are like fake eyelashes I got, right? But I honestly just don't think fake eyelashes suit my like eyes. I feel like they make them like smaller. What do you guys think? I tried to do like a more winged liner to copy Miss Grande. And I noticed she has like shorter eyebrows too. Now it's time for the hair. And surprisingly enough, I am actually worse at hair than makeup. I know, right? In the picture, she's like, her hairstyle is like what like Bella Hadid, like all like the celebrities hairstyles is like, you know? So I don't know how people really do that, but we're gonna try. And I'm gonna unleash Erasmus. And the reason why my hair is so tangly is because it gets tangly like the third or fourth day after I wash it because my head, my scalp gets super, super itchy. And so I like literally like, it's like almost like uncontrollable. Like I have had an itchy scalp since I was like seven years old or something. The third or fourth day, I itch my head like crazy. So that's why my hair gets like super tangled and everything. If you guys want to know, fact of the day. I know that she has like a side part type-ish. This is not, I'm not doing this right, okay. You know what, we're just gonna wing it. And now I think I'm just gonna do a high ponytail. Can you guys see what I'm doing? Is this a great tutorial? Time for the extension, ladies. It's like this? Y'all, I'm like all kinds of confused right now. I think you just wrap it around. But I don't want to like Velcro my hair. Oh well, too late. I can't get this pack of body pins open. These goddamn nails. This is actually making me mad. Okay, this looks kind of shitty. And it definitely does not blend in with my hair. 
This is embarrassing. I'm bouncing. Whatever. We're gonna move on. Okay, we're moving on. This is really like uh, not going well. Like, where is my Jen Atkin? Wait, first of all, can we just take a moment to admire my nails? I did them yesterday and they're like this like reddish, mahogany-ish, brownish color, and I kind of love them. I I'm like that meme. I have a bald spot over here, but we're not gonna talk about that. Okay, so this is the finished look. Guys, why is it like kinda good? Like, so there's obviously spots where we can improve. For example, if we eliminated this bald spot, then I think we would be one step closer, but you know, life is, it is what it is. Well, we kinda look <laughs> a little bit like we don't have our life together. And as you can tell, the hoodie is definitely very short. So I had to wear some biker shorts underneath. We have a little bag some boots and that is the ariana grande look like i feel like a snack right now okay okay so now i'm gonna try to take some instagram pictures and try to really make this into a look you know Today is the last day of the challenge and can you guys just like guess who I am today? Well, I guess you guys wouldn't guess because like the title card will literally say but um, I am being Tyler the Creator today Like honestly, I didn't have a lot of the similar pieces that he has but I see like I was looking at his pictures and he wears like a lot of sweater vests So I kind of like combined a few of his outfits and we're just gonna go from there, okay? I'm not a really big fan of Tyler the Creator. Like, I just like don't really listen to him, but I have a friend who is obsessed with Tyler the Creator. And I know that he has like a golf line, right? Like golf wing, I think that's called. So today we're just wearing a sweater vest with a white collar shirt underneath, some brown corduroy pants, and like doing like an award show or something. He wore like Mary Jane's kind of like these. So, you know, I'm just pairing it off like that. And yeah, I think this oh 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 it is a look for today okay 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 check my bankroll a 400k for vehicle paint job look like ashy ankle let it y'all be dilute water down i'm big mac i'm quarter pound you chicken nugget fuck it travel bag balenciaga 30 thousand just for luggage financial advisor fucking flower boy is buzzing I'm just embarrassing myself. I'm about to say. Since this day is kind of short, since, you know, there's not much transformation going on, I have another outfit to show you guys for Tyler. So, BRB. Okay, so I kind of look like a librarian that is mixed with Arthur, but you know what? It's fine. So, I just have this like yellow wool Argyle sweater. Um, it's actually kind of cute. It's on my Depop at Lindsay Clothes if you want to snatch this. I paired it with like this like green collar underneath that doesn't match. But you know, that's the vibe we're going for. We're going for colors today with the same brown corduroy pants. Like the bottoms are the same. But that is the end of the video. Those are all seven outfits I have for this week. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys showed on my last video. Honestly, it means the world. So let me know if you guys want me to make this into like a series or something. Like I have a few more ideas in mind. I think that's all I have for today. So as always, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.